Hey guys, Legal Lockpicker here. Uh, we have a whole lot to get through, so let's jump right in. Uh, yesterday, uh, in a not yesterday, but the day before, I had a video, and if you followed the video at at the all the way at the end, if you commented on that video and said you watched the entire thing, uh, I was going to do just a quick giveaway just for all the people that sat through me trying to get through that lock. Um, and this is the uh, Pro Series 7050. Um, I think it's a yeah 7050 giving away these are brand new I am and I'm going to pick a winner today and I'm going to post that winner in the description below so make sure you check that out I'll also post it on Twitter as well so make sure you follow me at uh, legal lock picker on Twitter as well I do giveaways on there and it's a great chance to catch up and uh, let me know what you think so this is what that prize was so check in the description for your name and who knows You'll have to keep watching my videos to win more. <laughs> All right, so today's video, I have this cam lock I got off of eBay. It was uh, $10, and that was to have it delivered. And I thought this was like a regular, normal cam lock. It turns out it, it was a behemoth. I mean, this is a large, large cam lock. So we're just just the faceplate alone is um, an inch and a quarter so one inch and uh, 1.25 inches that's pretty big in fact larger than the regular ones you have so um, it was really surprising and the reason I purchased this is because of these keys I was like wow these keys are really cool so check out that they you can see that it's indented on there kind of like a dimple a dimple key dimple lock key so I was like wow that's pretty interesting. I need to have it. That's what I did. So this is kind of what it looks like on the face. I see if I can. Well, at least you can see the phone. All right. So that's not doing you any good either. So I don't know how I'm going to do this. There, I'm going to zoom in and check, check it out. I'm not sure if you can see it, but there are two lines of pins. Oh, there we go. There are two lines of pins, one on the left, one on the right. And the idea is to somehow tension it and then pick it at the same time. So that is what we are going to do. All right, so put this away here. So what I'm going to do is, so here's the first thing we're going to do. Um, well maybe I can, I'm going to take this right here, which I, you would think because of the little shutters in here, I would use it to spread them. Actually, I'm going to stick these in um, at an angle like this. So you can still see the, um, it pushes the shutters aside, but then it also gives me some room to work. Then I'm going to take this other tension wrench here. I'm going to push it up here in a cross. That way I can give myself some room to work with. So I keep my finger up here at the top so I can push down so it doesn't eject out really quick. And then I can use these two here to give it tension. So now we've got tension and we've got uh, the shutters being cleared. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use this rake here from Tool, the brand new ones, try to get those sides. Okay. All right. Now there's... Once you have these things done, you hit the left side, right, and then we're going to turn it over and hit, hit the right side. Got it. 
see here we go all right so there you have it ladies and gentlemen uh, this is a very difficult lock to pick uh, but once you get over the the tensioning and the moving it side to side there you can find that anything is possible uh, i hope you guys enjoyed this video um, and if you have make sure you subscribe and leave me a comment if you found as locks that you thought you were getting something and you got something else and it turns out that you really you really like that lock and it really kicks ass and you're glad that you purchased it because it turns out to be a lot more fun than you thought it would be all right guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time